worked out that, that was 800 miles of cling film a year that we were using, which was the length of Britain. And I think even if you start with one thing, if you change from plastic straws to paper or veg compost, do one tiny step at a time. I think it's really important that we as a restaurant make a stand and that we have made it viable and it has been incorporated into our business model. It's not costing us money, that's really important. It's really important as a business to know your power and know that we are at the bottom but we can have a big impact by our pushback. And eventually, if everyone is pushing back on the same um, issues and the same plastic consumption, then the suppliers will have to uh, change them. So yeah, for me, it's really all about living and breathing what you're saying and being genuine. Take London, for example. You know, London for me is like a microcosm of the entire world. We've got every nation here. We've got every culture here. We've definitely got every cuisine here. And it has become a real gastronomic hub. And I think we have the opportunity to show real leadership here, to take a great example. Let's make ourselves a plastic-free aisle, not as the supermarket are, but an island, and really show that, that we can make tremendous change.